Hebrews reading is Psalm 128, the first egalitarian translation. Happiness come to those who fear the Lord and walk in God's way. You will eat what your hands have worked for. You will be blessed and prosperous. You will be a fruitful vine and the heart of your household. Your children will grow up around the table, spring up like an olive tree. This is how you will be blessed if you fear the Lord. May the Lord bless you from Zion, and may you see the prosperity of Jerusalem all the days of your life. May you live to see your children's children. Peace be on Israel. Our contemporary reading is from Barbara Brown Taylor, Learning to Walk in the Dark. I cannot remember the last time I've heard someone use the word dark to describe something good. Fear of the dark has been sanctified in so many people's mind that I have to define my term, not once, but over and over again. Because without constant reminder, the darkness is like a synonym for moral or spiritual danger. Most people I know revert to the equation without thinking about it. It is as if they have a defect set for darkness in their mind. When I run from darkness, how much do I really know of what we're running from? If we run away from darkness, no principle. Doing everything to avoid it because it's simply no telling what it contains. Is there a chance that what we're running from is God? 